the idea that there should be no distinction between private wealth and public wealth had become very deep-rooted, especially amongst the political classes. And I think the most important change which we have noticed in the past five years is that for the first time since 1947, or maybe even before that, we have started rolling back the tide of corruption. Corruption hasn't ended, don't get me wrong. Corruption hasn't ended. It still exists. It still eats into the soul of India. But at one level, at the top, there has been a huge exponential drop. And that's why I'm saying we've started, the tide was always advancing. We were getting corrupt, corrupter, corruptist, maybe to taking liberties with the English language. Now we've started ruling back. And that doesn't please a lot of people. And that doesn't please a lot of people, but they can't say it. So they find other ways of expressing it. Ways of expressing it depend. Saying no, no, they, they establish a moral equivalence, etc. <laughs>